Hi everybody, welcome back to Time Predicts and this is another reading. Today we are doing their current feelings of what's going to happen, what are they going to say, how are they feeling, you know, what they, a lot of times we do not know how they're feeling or what do they really want to say uh, to us and it's shaking. <laughs> Let's see what are the messages for you. Let's just quickly jump into the reading. Calling in your soulmate. They feel lonely without you. They feel lost without you. They think that you are their soulmate. I feel they are also doing manifestations to get you back. I feel that this is so meant to be because you guys, I when I was going to do a reading, it was 444. I also took out the oracle cards here and I was like counting my cards. Have I lost any cards? And it was like 44 oracle cards of the romance angels. So it's a, eight is a huge number. So it's 44. And I just saw 44 when I spoke on the counter. I wish I could show it to you. But this is all about stability, calling in your soulmate, partnership. And uh, I feel you are ready. I feel you are ready for a great partnership. They are ready for a great partnership. So if they haven't reached out or if you want to know how they're feeling right now and they haven't told you uh, what kind of feelings they have, I really feel that this is such a soulmate connection. They think that you are a soulmate, okay? That's beautiful because they want this partnership and I really feel they think, I told you, romantic uh, feelings never fail, fail to come in my <laughs> readings and uh, your feelings are uh, real and worth exploring. They are actually feeling very romantic towards you. They have feelings towards you and uh, look at the closeness, like I always say, look at the bond. I feel a lot of chemistry, a lot of attraction yes and uh, really really physically uh, both you both are very nice looking and really attractive and what pure souls because you've got soulmate card and i feel this is a this is a uh, this is a relationship or a friendship or whatever you call it worth exploring maybe uh, if it's not really reached that level of uh, love it will reach that level of love because i get romantic feelings and they always come in my readings <laughs> So the sun starts beautiful because today I was like, I want to be on an open mind. I did not think what would it be normally. I do have an inkling that yes, the reading is going to be about this. But today I was like, let's see, I'm just not going to think and say anything in the beginning. Guys, very important card. Pay attention to the red flags. Remember, this is a general reading. That's why I said today I thought I will have a lot of different messages. So guys, that happens. There are a lot of different messages. So please take care of the red flags. Red flags are also not about deception or them seeing somebody else or lying or cheating. I also feel red flags are sometimes things are not right in your relationship. If you think things are not uh, right, I really think that uh, you need to talk to them or you really need to have a chat to understand what's not going uh, right or what's going wrong. If you're not feeling something is right in the relationship, I really think you should have a chat with them, you know, instead of just putting everything in your mind. See, the signs are cautioning you. There's something the signs are saying, hey, they used to be very friendly with me, but now they're not showing the same interest or... Um, they used to call me so many times why have their call uh, you know calls reduced so uh, this is uh, you know something that uh, it's saying that pay attention to the red flags if something is amiss in the relationship or something you've seen their behavior has changed do not just you know uh, let go of that at least uh, notice it and if they're not noticing it you should tell them that you know something has changed for some of you there is disconnect somewhere wanting to retreat or wanting to uh, just disconnect from the world i feel you're in a situation where Remember, this is a general reading, so any any of the message could resonate for you. You want to disconnect from someone. You want to uh, move away. I don't get a walk away. Uh, what I get is uh, taking a step back. You know, you're like I've done a lot. Now I'm taking a step back. I want to see how they they react to me or how they do. They want me back or not? I think some some of you are testing your lovers. I mean, that's another message that I get. It's a very different message, but definitely you are testing your lovers. God. This is deception, guys. See, what a red flag. Oh, God. Okay, for some of you, if you did stumble upon this reading, it says there is something not right. Look at this. Now, I'm going to take this as a serious deception card because I don't know. I was not getting a feeling there is deception. I think this is some way, you know, look at this. Free yourself. This is free yourself. This is deception. And I think this reading is for two, three people where it is like a retreat. You understand, you know. You want to free yourself. Either you know they're deceiving you. Either you know that, you know, probably they're behaving, not behaving right. And you want to free yourself. Either it's just in your mind. Whatever it is, I think you really have to have a talk. Because I don't know. Somebody is not telling you the truth. It, deception is not just third party situation, guys. Always I say that. It's somebody is not telling you the truth. Maybe they're hiding things from you. Maybe they're hiding. Um, are they married? Or are they seeing somebody else? Or they're saying, hey, I'm busy. But they're not busy. But there is somebody hiding something from you. So remember, deception could also not just be that they are seeing somebody else or there's somebody else in their life. But it is also that they're not telling you everything. 
for some of you getting to know each other i knew it that i knew it that today's reading will have so 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 many uh, different uh, uh, you know uh, cards for everybody it's like uh, depends on what you want to take out from here so getting to know each other for some of you it's important to talk to each other maybe you need to know the person you are with or it just it could be a very new relationship and uh, it's just started with a lot of playfulness you still at that um, you know period or uh, in your relationship it is just about uh, you know having that great time and romance has just started and it's more beautiful and uh, i think yeah you started to getting to know each other i really feel you know each other from two months that's the um, that's another message that i get you can ask a question in your mind and maybe there's an answer from it from it here your answer could be here it could be a yes or no or any other kind of time frame you're looking for we've got the angel oracle cards angel answers what do you want to tell people who are listening to this so frame the question in your mind let's see five cards maybe there's an answer for you you know you if you were waiting for something there's an answer remain positive okay so a lot of you this is a beautiful card it asks you to remain positive have positive thoughts not to uh, like really think negative because if you think negative actually the situation it always becomes your reality whatever you're thinking look at this choose new direction so some of you are freeing yourself or you freed yourself from the person you are with maybe you wanted a sign choose a new direction remember this is a guidance guys if i'm saying something doesn't mean you break up with the person you're seeing and you're like oh i heard this video you exactly you know maybe you were almost on the brink of breaking up or you've al already done that and if you wanted a confirmation on that success is a beautiful card it could be material success i also get romance success relationship success beautiful improving health for some of you you've already freed yourself this could be just a past past could be like a month ago a week ago you freed yourself it says improving your health here what do you want people to know one perfect timing this is timing for if you want to start a new relationship if you want to leave someone if you were deciding to walk away if you thought i want to work on my relationship depending on what your mood was in the relationship i really think this is perfect timing guys this is the time to react and it's it's the time to probably choose a new direction or um, do what you think is right in your relationship that's the most important thing you know, a lot of times yeah i knew today's reading is for you know there are a lot of messages so that's why i did not start with saying you know it feels like this oh, look at this milk and honey so a lot of success for you it says milk and honey it's going to be all roses no thorns in your relationship this is for some of you i'm getting a lot of number nine though this is number six also multiples of three if your birth month or birth date anything anything to do with multiples of three maybe that's really nice for you come to the edge some of you really have to push yourself or the other other person you are in love with uh, to really um uh, push yourself you know to probably express i think one of you needs uh, to make to make more effort to show love or they make uh, need to make more effort to show love regeneration guys for some of you this is a new beginning it's also old old uh, you know exes coming back i also get exes coming back i get reconciliation i get new things happening this is beautiful I mean, you could have had a very bad relationship. You could have healed from it also because I've got improving health here. And once things were fine, I think I think even if you guys broke up or even if your relationship was so bad, but look at this. Even if there's lava everywhere, there's a new tree here growing, new new tree with green, uh, beautiful brown branches and there's green grass. So maybe if your relationship wasn't really good, but I feel there is a chance that it's going to turn around. Okay, that's another message that I get. For some of you, it's a spiral situation going round and round with no answers. You, uh, you are like tired of this. You know, it's it's uh, repeating. There's a pattern repeating. Okay, I get for you a pattern repeating. And if there's a pattern repeating and you do not want to do this anymore, so guys, you know your answer. 
the fates i feel um, you're actually on the right direction or whatever you are wanting to do i think with this reading the collective reading the main take out that i get is you already know what to do with your life okay you are ready for it and you're like this is my this is the fate is not like really uh, you know soppy and crying oh this is my fate and this will happen i have to do this the fates here is you're destined to be on a path either to walk away from them to be with them disconnect with them or to make a decision or you know have let let another person come in your life or be with the you know get an ex back you know if you really miss them or probably your ex is coming back but this is totally a fated connection guys remember that time to take a nap for some of you you've not been sleeping at all so breathe easy i get especially if you were a february born or a november born you've not been really sleeping well it's time to take a nap and uh, and see this is also six number so i think somewhere it's about improving sleeping in a way so that's important for you and look at this at the end of the deck it's mending so some of you are actually on the path of thinking of mending it but i think here the reading is all about taking an important decision what you think is right or you know it's or it's time to take a decision because yes uh, you know because the uh, the timing was perfect it was divine timing and i think it's time to do what you think is right you know don't don't pro procrastinate that take a decision make a decision and you're on the right path to make the decision and i think it's it's time to make the decision what i get really again and again that's why i'm repeating myself it's really time to do what you think is right in the relationship so those were the messages and yes a lot of messages for a lot of different people so uh see what guidance you really needed and what you really needed need to do so take care and i'll be back with another reading thank you guys bye